Now I would like to invite to stage to take the lecture to Mrs. Greta Thunberg. A year and a half ago, I didn't speak to anyone unless I really had to. But then I found a reason to speak. Since then, I've given many speeches and learned that when you talk in public, you should start with something personal or emotional to get everyone's attention. Say things like, our house is on fire, I want you to panic, or how dare you. But today I will not do that. Because then those phrases are all that people focus on. They don't remember the facts, the very reason why I say those things in the first place. We no longer have time to leave out the science. Without seeing the full picture, we will not solve this crisis. Finding holistic solutions is what the COP should be all about. But instead, it seems to have turned into some kind of opportunity for countries to negotiate loopholes and to avoid raising their ambition. <laughs> to stay below 1.5 degrees, we need to keep the carbon in the ground. Only setting up distant dates and saying things which give the impression of that action is underway will most likely do more harm than good because the changes required are still nowhere in sight. The politics needed do does not exist today, despite what you might hear from world leaders. And I still believe that the biggest danger is not in action, the real danger is when politicians and CEOs are making it look like real action is happening when, in fact, almost nothing is being done apart from clever accounting and creative PR. There is no sense of urgency whatsoever. Our leaders are not behaving as if we were in an emergency. In an emergency, you change your behavior. If there is a child standing in the middle of the road and cars are coming at full speed, you don't look away because it's too uncomfortable. You immediately run out and rescue that child. And without that sense of urgency, how can we, the people, understand that we are facing a real crisis? And if the people are not fully aware of what is going on, then they will not put pressure on the people in power to do, to do act. We do not have to wait. We can start the change right now. We, the people. Thank you.